Our junior kindergarten and kindergarten programs provide an extraordinary beginning for a child's formation and education. We start the kids on early with uh, in literacy, numeracy. We have a uh, Montessori play. We have collaborative play, manipulative play for them. We have arts and craft. Uh, Reggio Emilia built in, and what I would call a more traditional, more academic focus than you might find in um, like a daycare setting. We also have uh, specialist teachers, physical education, uh, Spanish and music teachers that uh, gives us a well-rounded academic uh, program in our school. There is still a big emphasis on the importance of play and inquiry and having the students um, engage in activities where they're having a lot of fun, but they're learning a lot at the same time. So sometimes they don't realize they're learning, but they are. We've been so impressed with uh, Clearwater's uh, communication. Um, we have a very close contact with our uh, teachers and they keep us up to date in terms of any activities, events, expectations, etc. It's been lovely to see that they are invested in the journey as much as we are as well too. In our kindergarten program, our students are all reading and writing by the end of the program. So when they go into grade one the following year, they're, they're set up with those foundations and um, can hit the ground running. But what we've especially noticed is that when we attend mass, the level of respect and um, decorum that our young children have in church has been um, amazing because of what they've learned uh, here at Clearwater in terms of structure and um, understanding of their faith. And as they come to Clearwater, I think they come through the doors and they have a sense of that it is different, that people here really do care. I feel like my child, as a little four-year-old or a five-year-old when they first get dropped off, is going to be loved and taken care of. And then through that, the journey begins at the school. When they graduate, they leave the doors of Clearwater Academy when they're 17, 18 years old and they go out in the world. They have a real good sense of who they are, what they're called to do, um, how they can serve others. Um, but it started when they just were a little four-year-old and their parents were just saying, I feel okay about letting them go into Clearwater Academy. I've made the right decision. 